So today we did an, uh, we exercised an emergency uh, deployment readiness exercise. Basically what that is, is we uh, practice responding to a crisis. We mobilized the entire battle group. We went through the procedures of going uh, and drawing ammunition, moving to a staging area, make sure all our com communications are working and that we're able to talk to each other. And then we move into an assembly area and wait for a uh, follow on mission. This was unique because this was our first time, but it also we mobilized the entire battle group to include our uh, ally partners, which you know are Romanians, the United Kingdom and the Croatians. Why is it important to do exercises like this? Well, it's important because the purpose of the Enhanced Forward Presence Battle Group uh, Poland is we're supposed to respond rapidly to any crisis, and that ha takes constant practice. And so this and through the subsequent ones, we really see ourselves being able to deter threats by being able to respond rapidly to any type of uh, crisis or emergency situation. Let's talk about your soldiers first. Uh once the dark rifles, what does it mean to you seeing uh, your team uh, marshal, alert, and deploy? Like, how does it make you feel seeing what you saw today? Well, I'm incredibly proud. I mean, we, we've practiced for years and years for this moment. We have rehearsed and rehearsed to be able to transition from inaction to action. I call it our fire drill. Being able to go from, you know, doing what you're doing, be alert, and then deploy, and then quickly out and be able to uh, respond to any threat. Our soldiers are incredibly motivated, and I think this is a great learning opportunity, not only for ourselves, but how we operate with our allies. Uh, so you mentioned allies, so how does it make you feel seeing the Romanians, the British, the Croatians come together uh, toward a common goal like this exercise? Well, what stood out today is the, the absolute professionalism and the, high, and the, and the great uh, demonstrated training that our allies have. I mean, they're excellent at what they do and uh, really watching them and how they operate really taught us a lot. And I look forward to how as we continue to do more of these exercises, we're just gonna get uh, faster and better and be able to respond quicker uh, throughout the coming months. What does stronger, stronger Together mean to you in relationship to this exercise? Well, what Stronger Together means really in this exercise is first, notice that each one brings a, a unique uh, capability that ourselves don't have. For example, the Romanians bring the capability to respond to anti-air threats. The Croatians bring a capability for long-range fires. You know, the United Kingdom brings the capability really to look deep and, and let us know uh, the likely approach of enemies. And then, you know, we bring the capability to find and, and finish the fight with our infantry. So just by ourselves, uh, we're, less, we're not as capable and not strong, but together we're a highly potent fighting force. What do you want to add, sir? Oh, Tarek, you know, really it's a great exercise for us really to, to shake out the dust and really to exercise that principle we say so often here in Battle Group Poland that we're stronger together.